What is going on guys? This is Ben here. In today's video, we are going to be maxing out the new card that just came out the other day, the Royal Hog. So you can see we have a bunch of them. We have 2,447. I think it takes like 2,500 and some to max it out. So we're fairly, fairly close. Uh, if you want to check out the Royal Snowball, not the Royal Snowball, the Giant Snowball getting maxed out, check out yesterday's video. Uh, it's, we had some awesome matches with it. But over the next few days, you're going to see some crazy battle decks with it. So let me know if you guys have awesome, any awesome battle decks with it. Or if what you think of the new cards, do you think they're bad, do you think they're good, uh, stay tuned, subscribe to the channel, and let's get right into this. Uh, honestly, it was actually fairly easy to max, like, get a lot of, usually it's a lot harder to max out the cards. I think they made a change with the chest where it makes it easier to get them, um, like cards that you don't have previously. So I'm excited for that change, but I'm not going to be able to fully max it out on this goal here. I'll probably be able to get it to, uh, I'd say probably level... I don't know, level 12? I mean level 10. <laughs> I, I thought it was a common at first. What an idiot! <laughs> I totally forgot it was a rare. Well, that was a little bit of a brain fart. Uh, yeah, so I need to try and get a couple more of them. I'll open up the lightning chest. Do I have it in my fortune? Oh, I do have it in my fortune. Never mind. We're gonna open up the fortune chest. Hopefully, because I have two rares. I have a rocket and, and I have the royal hogs. So hopefully it just gives me royal hogs instead. This is probably going to be the common, the Barbarian, so we're guaranteed two of them. Show me the Royal Hogs, please. There we go. So we only need less than 100 more to max out the Royal Hogs. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm getting excited. Don't really care about the Barbarians. Show us the Royal Hog. Not the Rocket. We don't need the Rocket. So that one was a wasted chest. Come on. It has to be the Royal Hogs this time around. There we go. So we only need to open up the Royal Hogs. And we get a Legendary out of the Fortune Chest. Okay. Uh, it's going to be good for gold, so I'll actually take it. Because the gold cap has been raised to 5 million. As you can see down there. But we only need to... How many more do we need, actually? So we need 39 more. Um, I can either do a couple Lightning Chests or just go for it in one go. Try and get in the Fortune Chest. So we still have one more chance. You may hear Chloe barking. I think Carla did just get home. So there we go. We got it out. We're going to max it out. I'm excited for this. Hopefully you guys are as well. Um, It's 100,000 gold. I kind of forgot about that. So there we go. Getting that to max level. The max level Royal Hogs. Uh, they do 87 damage. And that's just for one of them. Damage per second is 79. And their hit points is 1,011. All right, so now we are entirely maxed again. No more trying to win with level one Royal Hogs and Giant Snowball. Max Royal Hogs, and this guy is a, right off the start. No hesitation. Furnace. Um, That is actually going to be, a, unless, unless I can get rid of it right now, it's going to be troublesome. Hopefully the Rascal Girls can go through and just get rid of it so I can go in with my Royal Hogs. Valkyrie is going to be an incredibly great counter. You can see, sadly, the furnace is still alive. I thought it would have dropped a lot quicker than that. Uh, I don't want to get too much tower damage, so I'm going to log all of that stuff. I mean, we got some decent tower damage, but I do have a level 5 miner to deal with. Um, I'm going to have to eat the damage. This guy is incredibly aggressive right here. Throwing down the lumberjack. Uh, well... Tough start to this one. Furnace. Okay, I guess. I'm gonna go Goblin Barrel here, see if he has a log or... I don't know. Basically, just see if he has a log. It does not look like he does. Okay. Well, throw on the Rascal Girls. We don't want to keep eating Fire Spirits. I don't know if he has a counter for the Rascal Girls, to be completely honest. So, we're doing okay. I don't know what the... this. I don't know what this guy's win condition is yet. I'm gonna leave the musketeer. I'm not really scared of of the witch. I'm really scared of the Valkyrie though, so I'm gonna log this just so we don't eat a ton of tower damage there. I have to get this out of my hand. Like I can't deal with the Valkyrie. The Valkyrie actually shreds me right here. I guess we'll go in the Goblin Barrel. We ate a ton of damage, but we got a tower, I guess. I, so I, I mean, I guess we're okay with that. Just do a fireball. Take care of the furnace. Um, I I don't I don't know. Should I go to my royal hogs right now? 
kind of want to. This guy's really sitting back. Okay, it's Lava Hound. I should have guessed that. Actually, no, I have no idea. <laughs> I shouldn't have. I don't know. It's an interesting battle deck for sure. Typically, you don't see those combinations of cards. Valkyrie does get dropped this time. Oh, uh, we're throwing the Rascal Girls. Musketeer, what are you doing? You're supposed to take care of the Lumberjack so you can live. Dude, I can't really stop the Valkyrie, so I had to like drop the Royal Hogs and try and get to the tower. And they, they still got to the tower. Oh my gosh. So the Valkyries turned around and went for him. Or went for the Royal Hogs. Rascal Girls coming out and Rascal Boy being the distractor. Let's fireball all those Valkyries, dude. Wow. Wow. We held them off. No way he's going to be getting those double towers, but that one was tough. For sure. And let's hop into the next match. It's crazy. Crazy Panda. Um, let's see. What do I want to do? I don't know. <laughs> uh, bats? I, I guess I don't have my giant snowball, so I guess that's fine. Trying to defend with our goblin gang here. Well, you know what? We're pushing here. Hopefully it doesn't have a fireball. So the P.E.K.K.A. is going to be troublesome, but it's not going to be the end of the world because, like I said, our royal hogs. They're pretty solid versus, versus P.E.K.K.A. Um, I think I might have made a misplay here. No, our rascal girl should be fine. She should be able to take care of that. We did eat the... Uh, whatever it's... I don't even know what it's called. The battle ram. We ate the battle ram damage, but... I guess we're okay. I'm just going to let my elixir recharge here. I can't be really super aggressive at the moment. I... I, I can't. I can't. <laughs> uh... We'll throw muskets here this side. Hopefully that knight does not get a hit. It was close. It was really, really close. Um, He probably has a log, or at least a zap, right? Oh god, so this guy's rocking three musketeers. 100%. Three musketeers with his P.E.K.K.A. So I need to win early. Otherwise, I'm just going to get obliterated. But you can see the Royal Hogs coming in clutch, man. Oh my goodness. Solid. The giant snowball, all the bats and stuff. Well, we were able to survive. We're going to be facing through Musketeers. There's no, uh, there's no way he'd be running Elixir Collector without it. So, as long... I think we have a pretty solid matchup. I think we'll be okay. He's just opting to pump up? Well, I'm going to Royal Hog that, honestly. Like... I, yes, it's a. They're gonna take care of it. That's why I feel like it's a good, a good call. Cause it's five elixir and his is like six elixir. Did I miss two of them? I think I did. Well, I was mainly going for over here on this side tower. But now I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna eat some damage here for sure. As long as I don't lose two towers or get three crowned, it's not the end of the world. I can lose a tower here. I just cannot get three crowned. Depends where he drops the next two musketeers. Thirteen seconds left. I'm saving the fireball log for there we go. The log wasn't even necessary, but Whew. got it, man. Royal hogs definitely were the reason why we won that match. If we would have had hog rider, no, because that Pekka would have destroyed it. Not bad. We'll flex on him, and then we'll continue on to the next one. So we're already in the climb. We got back up to Master 1, okay. Unlock it, that's good for it's good for Clan Wars and finally back up there. Uh, what, do I wanna do one more? Yeah, we'll do one more with our maxed overall hogs. The fortune came in clutch. So, I don't know what, I don't know how we got to that screen. We wanted to get into a battle. <laughs> Last battle here, can we, can we do it? Can we win again? Almost just, you, yeah, you guys didn't see that. I almost just tripped on my chair. Oh, <laughs> uh, furnace. I don't like facing the furnace. That's a really good card against me. Uh, I don't want a fireball, but I kind of do. Now I'm going to regret it, aren't I? Right? Probably going to regret this. 
Mm. I'll eat those fire spirits. I'm okay with that. I don't want to eat all the skeletons and and the other fire spirits. But so the fire spirits are gonna be nasty versus me, man. Oh, well, I was not expecting Royal Giant at all. Well, that kind of sucks. Uh, eight quite a bit of damage. If I drop the Royal Hogs, there's gonna be the Furnace. He has Fire Spirits. Oh, no, this is not good. Well, at least it's on that lane. Please don't have a Log. I know you have Fire Spirits. Just please do not have a Log. I'm gonna preempt the Log for his Fire Spirits. He has arrows! No! No, no, no! That's not good. We still got some decent tower damage. Um, gonna drop the Goblin Gang. We're gonna get Royal Gianted here. Probably. Well, well, well. That's gonna be cause for a fireball for sure. Eating a ton of damage though, I don't like that. Our tower is really, really weak. Oh, man. Look at them rascal girls though, take care of those fire spirits like they're nothing, man. Well, that's pretty cool. This is this is preamping for fire spirits. Again, I cannot. Let's have more variants too. <gasps> ah, no! We're getting some decent tower damage there, so I just have to cycle. All right, they're alive. Our tower is still alive. 30 seconds left. Maybe going in with the Royal Hogs again. Giant Snowball preempt this time, and it worked out perfect, thank you. Um, So he has arrows. Probably gonna be on my Rascal Girls. 20 seconds left, I'm going for another tower though. I have to. That was probably a wasted log. That, that was a wasted log, Ben. What are you doing? What are you doing, man? Fireballing the furnace because that's gonna basically shut down whenever I try to get to that tower. Oh, I do not like this spot. And he just got so much value. That's that's gonna probably seal. Because he just got Rascal Girl value out of that. Oh no. And those fire spirits got off in time. Oh my gosh, man. Preamping too quick. The struggle is real this match. Look at all that look at all that junk coming to the right hand side. These nice long overtimes. Skeleton Army. We call the right this time. Thank you. And the rascal girl. Let's Ooh, come on, do some more damage. A little bit more damage. A little bit more. Oh no. So we're in a bad spot here. Royal Giant gonna clutch. GG. Oh my gosh, man. Well played. Flex on him again. <laughs> I thought we, I thought he had that. We had a, that was not a good matchup for us. Those fire spirits were so scary. And I was trying to like predict the log coming or the fire spirits and I, I messed up like twice or three times in a row, but this is too much, man. The Royal Hogs, overwhelming. The overwhelming damage. So, not bad. Let me know what your thoughts are. We're in Max Royal Hogs OP. I don't know. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for more awesome videos. And I'll see you guys later.